And they're off in the San Juan Capistrano. Acclimate and Astronaut are the first two out. Pillar Mountain comes away in third, then Ward and Jerry. Lure him in is next. And Red King is content to be at the back of the field. Acclimate opens up early. He has a two and a half length lead. Lure him in, comes through on the inside of Pillar Mountain. And Warden Jerry is also up close. He's only two lengths off the pace now. Another three, Astronaut settles outside of Red King. Down the hill they go. And it is Acclimate, the controlling speed, saying catch me if you can. Has it by two lengths to Pillar Mountain. Ward and Jerry in hand at the rail in third. It's another four. Lure him in is back to fourth. Then Astronaut and stretch running Red King. Crossing the dirt, coming on to the main course. Ricky Gonzalez has Acclimate. Cruising along on the front end. Ward and Jerry on the inside of Pillar Mountain. A joint second. A gap of six to lure him in. Astronaut and Red King. The two San Juan Capistrano winners are first and last with a lap to go. Acclimate has it by four. Pillar Mountain in second. Ward and Jerry at the rail bides his time in third. Six lengths, maybe seven, back to lure him in. Followed by Astronaut and Red King. They have six furlongs to run and Acclimate to catch. Bounding along, two and a half in front. Ward and Jerry still under a nice hold on the inside of Pillar Mountain. Those two race together. A gap of seven lengths to lure him in. He is followed by Astronaut. And Red King is starting to gain a little bit of momentum to their outside. Past the half mile pole they go. And it's still acclimate. In fact, he's widened. Ward and Jerry clearly into second. Pillar Mountain third. Astronaut seven lengths off the pace. Umberto Rispoli has Red King on the outside of Lure Him In. Approaching the quarter pole and Acclimate still strong on the front end. Astronaut takes up the chase. The lead down to two and a half. Red King behind him. Ward and Jerry at the rail. They're at the top of the stretch. Acclimate trying to finish the job. And he's still in front by three. Astronaut, Red King in the center, and Ward and Jerry, a 16th to go. And Ricky Gonzalez on a joyride in the San Juan Capistrano. He's a two-time winner. Acclimate, coast to coast, the easiest of wins. Astronaut, second best. Red King was third. Photo for fourth, Ward and Jerry, and lure him in. Lots of cheers down here as Acclimate at seven years old still has it as he takes the San Juan Capistrano once again after taking it gate to wire in 2019 with all of the winning connections here. Ricky, I'll start with you. I saw a massive fist pump when you crossed the wire. What was the key to getting him home today? Just get him in front nice and comfortable where he likes to be. Just keep the other horses away from him and he's happy as he could be. <laughs> Just describe the emotion you felt when you crossed the wire first. Oh, I was really happy, you know, we barely got beat last time. It was just the head bob, but after the wire, he was in front again. So I knew the distance wasn't going to be a problem for him. So today it was just a relief that he, he got it done so easy. Thank you, Ricky. Congratulations. Thank you. I, Judy Johnston, part owner and a breeder of Acclimate. Right. I said he still has it at seven years old. He still has it. He took a little time off at the ranch. He liked his vacation, but he likes to run better. <laughs> so we all like vacations. Yes. He shows up each and every time, though. Right. Just describe how special this horse is to you. This horse is very special because we raised him. We raised his dad. His dad ran just like he does. They like to get in front and try to dare somebody to catch him. Nobody's not, there nobody today. Can catch him today. <laughs> Congratulations. And lastly, Phil, hey, this horse has to mean a lot to the barn. You've had him for quite some time. Describe how you're feeling right now, this horse getting back into the winner's circle and your third consecutive San Juan. You know, just I'm elated, really. I mean, this horse, you know, he's been through the highs and lows and, and he's bounced back, you know, and, and uh, he's just a old warrior and, uh, you know, he, he gave it his all today and it's just a something beautiful to watch. To all of the fans here, what does a seven-year-old winning a graded stakes race like he just did mean? 
Yeah, no, it, it means everything. I mean, it, it, it's a credit to my all my uh, staff, m my exercise riders, my assistants, and uh, definitely the owners, and uh, especially uh, Ricky. Congratulations. It is a team effort, a team victory here. Acclimate once again in the winner's circle for the San Juan Capistrano.